The Okanagan lost an iconic landmark with more than a century's worth of history overnight when the Holiday Park boat on Highway 97 went up in flames. The fire began at about 1.30 a.m. on the corner of the highway and Commonwealth Road, just north of Duck Lake. And it's the, uh, the boat that's been on the highway there since the, you know, the mid-80s, the blue boat. Uh, substantial in size and uh, um, being fully involved, it actually gone up the sails. Um, it was quite vertical in nature, so there was power lines uh, fairly close by. So our main objective at that time was just uh, knock it down, get it, get it so it wasn't impacting any of the infrastructure with regards to power lines. It's significant. There's a lot of that, that material's dry. It's, uh, it's uh, you know, obviously the boat's been there for a long period of time. Um, the sails are fairly high. There's some signage on the top of it. There's a lot of, a lot of fuel to get it uh, going vertical very, very quickly. The first truck in was able to kind of bring the vertical nature of the fire down towards the deck. However, there, we only had so much water and, uh, you know, it was smoldering, the decks were collapsing on, on themselves. So it really had to get pulled apart in order to really extinguish the fire. The 118-year-old boat had been at that location for close to 40 years. Pretty sure it's been uh, since about 83 that when the resort started in that, in that time frame. It was used as our um, sales office. It was brought over from Okanagan Lake. And... Uh, brought there uh, when the resort was uh, going to be developed. Once the resort got more established, it became you know, more advantageous just to make that a, a signage and, uh, and retain it as a sort of a resort landmark. And it um, looks like it's become almost a community landmark now. And well, it started with the thought, this is uh, an early morning, <laughs> you know, uh, joke here, um, April Fool's Day, but uh, obviously not. And then we ended up heading down there and watching it burn uh, the rest a bit as they were trying to put it out. And like I say, at least nobody was getting hurt. But uh, yeah, pretty sad, pretty sad. Fire investigators have not yet determined the cause of the blaze. For Castanet News, I'm Nick Johansson.